first thing up on the screen is the cross section of the mesh. On the left is the correct coating and exposure. As you can see, the mesh is totally encapsulated and the emulsion is exposed completely through from print side to squeegee side, creating a solid bond of emulsion on the screen. The lighter blue on the bottom to the right side of the correct exposure is what's called EOM, or emulsion over mesh. This is what tells ink where to stop. Ink is stupid and it needs a place to stop when it flows through the mesh. On the right side you can see an underexposed screen where we've not exposed completely through and we're washing emulsion off on the squeegee side rendering the stencil much weaker and possibly creating pinholes. You still have a little bit of an EOM but when you see the EOM on the screen it's rounded and thin and what happens is when you push the ink through the ink has a tendency to want to spread out underneath the stencil. So it's critical to coat properly and expose properly. I can't impress that upon you more than I just did. The next thing we do is throw an ink, some ink in the screen, a squeegee, and print it. And you can see that the correct exposure prints cleanly and the underexposed screen does not. These are things that happen all the time. These are questions we get all the time. And this is one of the typical, typical explanations as to what happens when the screen isn't coated or exposed correctly.